title of topic, Fertility and Contraception, Unit Year 9, RSE 1010, The Theology of the Body. The concept. The Catholic Church teaches that having children and producing a family is a gift from God. In Genesis, God told Adam and Eve to go forth and multiply. Fertility treatments are available to men and women in the 21st century to help them to have a baby if they are unable to have one naturally. Today, if a couple who are married, according to the Catholic Church, wish to have a baby and cannot, can seek medical help. This is called fertility treatment. There are many types of fertility treatments available to couples to help them have a baby. Medical technology has become very advanced. However, some Catholics believe that using artificial forms of fertility treatments may be compromising their belief in God. This is known as medical ethics. The image shows reasons for why men and women may have difficulty conceiving today. Year 9. Your flipped learning task is to research three examples of fertility treatments in a presentation, whether that is a PowerPoint or a Google slide, compare and contrast the differences and similarities between secular and Catholic views regarding having children using advanced medical technology. In your study, you should include a Catholic view on fertility treatments, a non-Catholic view on fertility treatments, a humanist view on fertility treatments, advantages and disadvantages of these treatments, costs of the treatments, and finally, your own opinion. To stretch and challenge yourself, you may want to add sowers, like the one that I have put from Psalms 113, verse nine, which reads, he gives childless couples a family, gives them joy as parents of children. You may want to reflect on the following. Biblical women who are unable to conceive at first. For example, Sarah, the mother of Isaac, Elizabeth, the mother of John the Baptist, and Hannah, the mother of Samuel. You may also want to look into the church's teachings. The Denou Vitae the gift of life. This document explains that technology to overcome infertility is not wrong. Some methods are moral, whilst others, because they do violence to the dignity of the human person and the institution of marriage, may be considered immoral. Finally, year nine, we are really looking forward to your finished product. We look forward to seeing your final outcomes, your presentations, when you are back in the classroom. Thank you very much for listening. God bless you all.